how much of a responsibility is it of R and A W to give when you give intelligence to the political leadership? Do you have to hand over intel as in proof intel like satellite maps or what to say? So, it depends. Sometimes. Satellite maps are given to show the location. After all, we gave handed over that tape. Musharraf talking to General Aziz Khan. Yes, please explain that what happened for those who don't know uh, about this whole conversation that happened. Tell us about that. You know, uh, when they had mounted this attack <clears throat> in uh, on the on Kargil, and up to a point they were doing well. We were uh, at the receiving end, and they were pounding us from heights. And then, as this tide began to turn. Musharraf had gone to Beijing and there he rings up Aziz Khan and they talk to each other and the conversation is inki to tutti hamare haath mein hai the the guys who are fighting and that we are controlling the whole operation so uh, mian nawaz ko zyada batane ki zarurat nahi hai unko nahi don't have to tell him anything just tell him everything is okay but we'll carry on like this Don't That, tell the prime minister. No, nah, don't tell the prime minister. Need to know basis hota hai. War ke time. Not the prime minister. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Ha. Huh. So that conversation gave evidence that the Pakistani they were saying that we have not done it. The infiltrators are the Mujahideen and all that they are actually involved. In. So R E W had taped that conversation. We had taped that con. We got that tape, and we uh, would never have sh- declared it, but uh, it was found expedient to declare it. and then that pipeline closed i mean the sense that we couldn't get hold of any open conversation like this when they visited abroad the next time they didn't use the same method of communication but did it aid in ending a war it made a lot of difference so after that nawaz went running to uh, bill clinton bill clinton because he had been done in by his own people yeah, yeah. suppose that line had not been there in that conversation ki mian nawaz ko batana mat hmm. it wouldn't have hurt no it would have hurt still hmm. because the fact is that you are admitting that you are doing it and saying you are not doing it therefore we are telling the world this is this is an invasion this is not a freedom fight You know, there's so much difference between Pakistan and India. When I was speaking with General Kulkarni, he mentioned this incident that when Operation Meghdoot, when Siachen was brought under Indian control, Benazir is said to have stormed into GHQ in Pindi, and uh, she's supposed to have brought bangles with her. I don't know. This is folklore, uh-huh. and she's supposed to have thrown the bangles on the table and said, "Churiya penlo, yeah. uh, Musharraf ko," that you have lost, yeah. and uh, she was killed. at some point of time i'm not yeah. saying musharraf did it but yeah. musharraf got his revenge in that yeah. she died bhutto at that time insulted general ayub khan the military mm. insulted he was assassinated you can never imagine a parallel in india so those who say india pakistan ikko hi hai mm. we are the same people mm. what do you have to say to that we are not the same people and here the 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 ethos is totally different if i mean look at the way our army function look at the way their army function they are overlords they rule the roost i met a pakistani once and he said i met he was an ex diplomat i i used to be a f- friend of uh, so and so who is now an air marshal i said yeah he's retired okay give me his address was visiting so i said so and so place uh, He was familiar with Delhi. He looked. Did did he? I said, did he flat? Air Marshal. I said, yeah. Come on, Ali ji. People make fun that he plot is done. Pakistan, let's leave him for that. That plots go. No, hai. it goes by rank. Hmm. You are allotted land by rank. Fertile hmm. land hmm. is allotted to the generals first, and then picking order. Me, go. Click here to watch the full episode.